and Raw kicks off with its new WWE Champion, the Tribal Chief, the head of the table, Roman Reigns. We're about to hear from Roman for the first time since winning the championship last night in that hellacious uh, elimination chamber matchup where he beat five of the top superstars here on Raw <clears throat> walk out with the gold as Roman Reigns last night proved why he is the head of the table and you see the special counsel Paul Heyman handing over the championship and Roman raising it over his head allowing the WWE Universe here in Turin to acknowledge him and Heyman holding that title in the air showing it off to everyone And Roman Reigns last night proved he is not all talk. He can back it up in that ring. As he earned his seat at the head of the table. So he is the big dog here on Raw now. He has the goal to back it up. But it also means he's got a target on his back now. Because he holds the one thing everyone on that Raw roster wants. And you gotta wonder who will be the first man to step up and challenge Reigns. As we see once again, Heyman hands over the belt to his tribal chief. As the bloodline now hold all the gold on Raw. The Usos, of course, the Raw Tag Team Champions. Roman Reigns, the WWE World Heavyweight Champion. And I'm gonna be quiet and I'm gonna throw things over to the ring where we will hear from Reigns. And we just heard from the new WWE Champion Roman Reigns after walking out of the Elimination Chamber with gold. King Nakamura, Shinsuke Nakamura laying out the challenge after Roman attacked him after the Elimination Chamber qualifying match. But we'll find out where that goes in the coming weeks. But we got tonight's action kicking off with our truth. As he's looking to introduce the WWE Universe here on Raw. What's up? Jump in, leaving the competition. I make him disappear like your favorite magician. And I ride it till the wheel fall off. I bounce back to back till they next get soft. Most of the time you see me, I'm being simple. No, Drew, he likes to have fun. He likes to sing. He likes to dance. Stating my claim to fame. We can also get the job done in the ring multiple time champion, former two time NWA World Heavyweight Champion is all true. I take it off the show, I bet. What's up? What's up? What's up? And he's looking to pick up a big one here tonight and maybe put himself in title contention whether that's the Wii Championship or United States Championship or truth he's looking to entertain the fans here in Turin but he has a tough opponent for the first time here on Raw we will be seeing Happy Corbin and will Corbin's luck be in here tonight against truth
and Corbin and he's one of those a lot of superstars facing the frustrations and not being even given a qualifying match for the Elimination Chamber but this is Corbin's chance to show the re-management what he can do and maybe on himself a few opportunities when things come around again like those qualifying matches you know win here overall true pick up a bit of momentum maybe go on a bit of a win streak happy Corbin could find himself in contention of course Corbin someone that believes he should be in the main events he should be at the top of the card well here's his chance to prove it You see Archery and his opponent, Happy Corbin, referee, getting ready to ring the bell. We are now underway. Archery going straight for Corbin with those strikes. Kick blocked by Corbin. Now Corbin sends Truth to the apron. Truth fighting back, though, fighting back into this. But gets caught by Corbin as he enters. And now Corbin, big power bomb drops out Truth. Big backbreaker by Baron Corbin. And a big fisherman suplex sends all through crashing does Corbin but truth now fighting back into this. Trying to get a bit of momentum has Baron into Corbin you know, just unleashing those hands. And now head first goes Corbin into that turnbuckle. And again those big right hands by Trude. Trude springs up and over. Out the back goes for the pin. Let's go. Truth now has Corbin in his sights. Drop kick to the side of the head. And Truth now up top rope. Big leg drop comes crashing down on Corbin. Goes for the cover. One, two, two count only. Truth, he thinks that's a three count, but referee here says so it's only a two. And now Archer picking up Baron Corbin. Corbin now grapples him, has him up, and slamming him into the corner and throwing him across the ring does Corbin. Now just head first driving Archer into the mat. And again a big fisherman suplex by Corbin. Goes for the cover, center of the ring, one. Only a count of one, all truth still fighting in this one. Into the corner goes truth. And head first. And again, head first goes truth. And Gordon just catches him with that spine buster. Again, unleashing those big strikes is Corbin and catches him for that slam across the knee. Goes for the cover, this could be it. One, two, three. Happy Corbin gets the victory here tonight over R Truth. And Happy Corbin proving that his luck is in with the win over Truth here tonight. And Raw continues on with women's division action. And it's almost a superhero, Nikki Ash. Looking to fly her way into a future WWE Women's Raw Women's Championship match. Go Charlotte Flair retaining the championship over Mickey James last night and no way out. <clears throat> the following contest Nikki, <clears throat> Nikki Ash looking. Making make a name for herself, looking like everyone else in the Rowan's division wants that shot at that championship. And again, a win here tonight. A bit of momentum can elevate Nikki into that title picture, but 
she has a very very tough challenge ahead of her and we'll get into that when her opponent comes to the ring like I said Nikki actually wants to earn her way up earn a shot at Charlotte Flair in the future but it won't be an easy task because everyone else in their own division wants the same thing they all, that's why they're all here they all want that gold including this woman Alexa Bliss and I don't think you can get many polar upsets here on Raw a bigger polar upset I should say in Alexa Bliss and Nikki Ash Nikki a fun loving superhero where Alexa is just I, I I don't even know how to exp how to describe Alexa Bliss. She's just creepy, just scary. Just you, no one knows what's going through the mind of Alexa Bliss. So we see Alexa now in the ring. <laughs> and we see Nikki Ash in one corner, Alex and the other. The bell has rung, we are underway. Both women looking to pick up momentum and possibly put their name in the hat for future Raw Women's Championship shot against Charlotte Flair as Bliss now catches Nikki. And just dragging her over to the corner, send her face first into the turnbuckle. And a big moonsault knees by Bliss. Going straight to the arm. And Bliss now soaking in the attention of the WWE Universe. And now those big boots to the midsection. Nikki comes from behind though with those kicks to the leg. Now sends Alexa to the corner. Does Bl er, Nikki Bliss go with the elbow? Now Alexa floats out of it, grabs Nikki by the neck, and the STO just smashing Nikki Ash's head into the mat. Nikki O catches the foot, dragon screw on Alexa. Bliss sent to the apron by Ash. Now Nikki dragging her back in with those vicious elbows, hit it back, just working over Alexa Bliss. And now that backstabber. And a big right hand by, or right left hand by Nikki Ash. Now back to the arm with that arm bar. Is Alexa going to submit? No, she's fighting out of it, turns it around. And big right hands by Bliss. And now Alexa going behind. Sleeper drop. <clears throat> now Alexa just grabbing Nikki's head, driving it into the mat. And those big punches unleashing by Alexa Bliss. But Nikki flying back with that kick. Once again, sends Alexa out to the floor. Come now after is that Nikki. As the referee begins his count, of course, ten count only as Alexa rolls through. And stomping away is Alexa Bliss. And a big slap by Alexa. Drop kick to the side of the head by Alexa Bliss. Now just working that arm is Bliss. It's referee up to a count of five, of course, a ten count here. As Alexa again, that moonsault knees up to six. As Alexa picks up Nikki. Wisely gets in to break the count, and she's she went for Nikki again. No, Alexa goes back out after her. 
and sends Nicky in. Boot to the midsection. And now Nicky Ash fighting his shots to the midsection of Bliss. Northern Light suplex by Nicky. Nicky is fired up here. And his big hands. And Nicky calling Bliss to her feet. Crossbody connects. Cover. One. Two. And Nicky. Not able to put Alexa Bliss away. Alexa getting the shoulder up at two. And Alexa fighting back with a big punch of her own. Snap mirror takedown. Hits the ropes. Big drop kick by Bliss. Goes for a cover. One. Count only. Knees drop. And again, the knees by Bliss into the midsection. And Alexa setting up Nikki. Big DDD planting. Nikki Ash head first goes for the cover. One, two, three. Alexa Bliss picks up a big win over Nikki Ash here on Raw. See Alexa getting her hand raised. And now Nikki showing a sign of respect to Alexa and Alexa reciprocates the handshake. Both women putting on a big performance here on Raw. But Bliss gets the win. And could that put her in line for a future Raw Women's Championship match? At Judgment Day, we'll have to wait and see. And it is main event time here on Monday Night Raw. As we got the phenomenal one, AJ Styles in action. Looking to pick up some momentum. After being defeated by Randy Orton in an Elimination Chamber qualifying match, AJ looking to get back at things here tonight. Making his way to the ring from Gainesville, Georgia. Playing in at You know, AJ making his way to the ring. The phenomenal one. And as I said, AJ looking to regain some momentum after his defeat to Randy Orton. And if I know AJ Styles, he's not happy at that defeat to Randy and he would love not more than to get some momentum going get things going on his way, but he is a big, big challenge. In the form of Braun Strowman, and his opponent, the monster Strowman, among North men. Carolina, weighing in at 385 pounds. And as I kind of mentioned with Cor Happy Corbin earlier, Braun Strowman is one of those men who has something to prove. Braun is one of those men who feels like he was overlooked. He feels like he should have been at least given a qualifying match for the Elimination Chamber. But he didn't. Because of course, WWE management didn't pick him. And Braun failed to overlook. Braun wants to prove a point. AJ Styles was given one of those qualifying matches. And Braun's looking to prove a point at the expense of AJ. And showing that AJ spot should have been given to Braun. As we are underway in our main event here. Strowman versus AJ. And now Strowman using his size just picking up AJ early on and just dropping him across the ropes. 
messing with the boot though as Edge avoids it arm drag using his speed which he's going to need to do as you see Braun just pushing him away <clears throat> and now Braun goes for a big choke slam drives AJ into the mat and again just bouncing AJ head first and now that Boston crab locked in Imagine someone the size of Braun Strowman just sitting on your back, cranking away. Imagine the damage that's doing to that back. That's fine as AJ fights back, connects with a knee. And AJ looking to fight, he's going to need, as mentioned, he needs to use the speed, he uses the knee, uses agility as he connects with that big elbow off the top. And according to AJ Styles, that was just too sweet. Now the springboard crossbody misses as Strowman rolls out of the way. Now Braun has AJ up on his shoulders and again just dropping him across the ropes is Braun Strowman. And Braun, where, where is Braun going? Braun going to the top looking to axe handle AJ but AJ avoided it. Now Braun sent out onto the apron AJ with that forearm. And again Stunner using the ropes to knock Strowman down. And Strowman back to sweet though AJ. I thought he was going to dive, but maybe realizing that wasn't the best thing to do because Strowman getting back in now and just throwing AJ around the ring. That hard Irish whip into the corner. Now AJ sends Strowman back out to the floor once again. This time follows him out. And going to work on that knee. Just got those vicious rapid elbows to the knee of Strowman. Trying to take out the base of the monster. And maybe trying to warm down for that uh, calf cutter, but AJ eats the DDT on the floor from Strowman. Now Braun, big powerbomb on the floor, just having his way with AJ Styles. And again, going to the knee of AJ. Referee up to a count of fours, Braun just throwing AJ around the ringside area. Braun in to break the count. Now just taunting AJ, telling him to come get these hands. And AJ says, that's just too sweet. Now in comes AJ. And gets instantly caught by Strowman and just trying to wear, pull the arms out of that socket. And the headbutt to the back. Braun blocks the... Now up on the shoulders once again goes AJ. And once again, set face first, this time into the turnbuckle. Uh, big boots in the corner by Strowman. And, oh, just kick to the midsection. And Braun Strowman, Strowman, why he's called the monster among men, just having his way with AJ. But AJ once again fighting back. Breaker by Styles and AJ Styles springboard 450 kind of connects with that clothesline and he's calling him to his feet. He's looking for the phenomenal forearm connects, drumming down center of the ring. AJ goes for the cover one, two, and Strowman kicks out at two. Strowman getting the shoulder up at two. And AJ hits the rope, vintage AJ sends with that knee drop. Now Styles looks to fly once again. Get ready to fly with the spiral tap. Goes for the cover. One, two, and again only a two count. AJ cannot believe it. He's throwing everything he's got at Strowman. Going for that submission, or going for the armbar. Trying to make Ron submit. Maybe he's like, I can't pin the monster. Maybe I can make him submit. Strowman though gets out with big right hands by Braun to break the hold. And AJ boot in midsection, DDD plants in Strowman on his head. And I was just kicking away at Strowman. AJ saying this is too sweet, goes for a cover, maybe wasting a bit too much time. 
Strowman gets it out, shoulder up. And again, DDT by Styles. Out onto the apron goes AJ. Calls Strowman to his feet. Phenomenal. Forearm misses. Strowman avoids a second forearm. Now Strowman in control. Just picking AJ up by the back of the neck. Reverse stroke slam. Goes for the cover. One. Count AJ kicking out a one. That may have just pissed the monster off even more. Running power slam. Hook of the leg. One. Two. And AJ, at the count of two, fights out of it. And now, in trouble as Braun has him up. Yosuka Cutter. Strowman just kick, kicks AJ up. Another one. Running. Power slam. One. Two. Three. And Braun Strowman picks up a big win in the main event here over AJ Styles. As we see your winner from Monster Among Men, Braun Strowman. And that's back to back defeats now to AJ. One to Randy, one to Strowman. As you see, AJ looks disappointed. He hasn't picked up a win here on Raw yet. But that's all we got time for. We tune in Friday for Friday night's Smackdown. Tune in next Monday for more Monday Night Raw, and we'll see you then.